Scenes of shootings and violence are not uncommon in the taxi industry. Recent taxi killings have taken place in Pal in the Poland. The Western Cape Transport Authorities say the route between Pal and Belleville has become more lucrative, leading to illegal operators. They say the remuneration system for taxi drivers must change. You have a situation where a driver is expected to make a particular amount a day uh, and then after that rush and make his own income. Now in that situation, you find that when the route is perceived to be lucrative, people will fight each other to have access to that route in order to make that money. What is it that we need to do as government is to provide some stability and stable income for people who are working in the industry. 63 people have died in taxi-related violence in the area before the lockdown. Municipal officials are concerned. People without permits is operating on the same routes uh, and people who are have having no license is also running on the same routes and then obviously people will have the assumption of the exception that we don't want to give them any permits. But some operators are still not convinced about government efforts citing corruption as fueling the violence. In the Bolan region, only the guys from the Bolan region got uh, enriched themselves with this red dot. Uh, now, our local guys didn't get any uh, red dot uh, from government. So the guys is not interested in this whole taxi scenario that's going on at the moment. The Western Cape Dexel Hotla is scheduled to take place for two days next week in Worcester and Cape Town. Tandi Swamau, SAPC, Cape Town.